If you're new here, welcome. Please subscribe and turn on your notifications in case you are chosen as the winner in the random comment game. Seven years. Okay. It's a while. Yes. I, that's when it, it started, but then as far as what I have been doing with it, you know, cutting it back mm -hmm. and filing it, uh, it uh, that's probably been the last uh, two years. Okay. And I just discovered recently that I have like a pronate on my, on my left. Yeah. And I've got uh, just purchased... Uh, it, it insoles to help adjust that and oh, it good. felt much better. So you have a few ridges in your nails. When we get ridges that grow vertically up mm -hmm. the nail, sometimes that's caused from medications or age. Once they start, there really isn't anything that you can do about it, but you also have one that's going horizontal to the free edge here. Oh. Um, and it takes about a year for the toenail from the cuticle to grow to the free edge. Mm -hmm. So anything that happened about maybe seven months ago, oh. you could either, you could have damaged it or you could have had it, something internally happened like sometimes when you get really sick okay. you get like a hiccup in the nail growth mm -hmm. so it's not anything to really worry about but when we polish them you'll be able to see that because I can feel mm -hmm. the roughness so I'm just gonna smooth the top of your nail plates just a tiny bit because mm -hmm. we don't need to thin anything out right. but just smooth so the polish mm -hmm. looks pretty gentle <laughs> <laughs> thank you yeah you have to learn over the years where, when and where to use pressure because this has a beveled edge and if you press too hard you can literally peel off this top of someone's nail plate oh. um, so once I start to feel a little bit of a lip of the skin mm -hmm. then I'll press down just a tiny bit harder and then push and then stop because you do need to remove that adhered cuticle off the nail plate. Mm -hmm. If you don't, nail polish won't adhere very well and it'll begin to chip. Yeah, but a more important reason is if, like, yeah, we can just go back and forth until we see that little lip disappear. And even though I can see the line, it feels very smooth. So I'm not going to go any further than that. Less is always more. Yes. <laughs> always, always, always. You have them all memorized? It got to the point, yes, because they said when ICD-10 come out, well, you're not going to memorize these, but we do. Yeah, you <laughs> we do. We end up getting fine, and, you know, we can, it, it's just habit, <laughs> so, even though there's seven, you know, numeric or alpha digits there, so. Right. Yeah. <laughs> 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 so. I go to YouTube for a lot of things to learn. Like I learned how to make all of my own websites on YouTube. Oh. I'm joking with my son, he's a, he does specialize welding out in the oil fields in North Dakota. Oh, nice. And um, well, there was something new for him to learn. And he, he was talking to me about it. It was some special weld. And, and I said, well, how did you learn that? He says, YouTube. 
<laughs> he was only kidding. <laughs> and I said, really? <laughs> he said, well, <"Mother." laughs> I guess I'm just a bit gullible. <laughs> so, but he said it is there, but yeah. <laughs> Yes, so this little area right here yeah. is just building up a callus because there's a sharp piece of nail down in here yes. and your body's just recognizing it as like, hey, I need to protect myself, so. Right. There. So I get that out of there and then your body will stop creating this thickness. Yeah, okay. Because I usually would take a pumice stone in. Oh yeah, try to get down in there. Well, just on the edge, if it would ever get built up, mm -hmm. uh, on the outside edge there. And, um, but then after years I thought, well, then I would start getting the pain as I got older. Right. And uh, what's going on here? So I started looking things over. And I said, well, the pain's coming from that knee all pushing. And I didn't have the nice equipment at that time. To... Right. Well, you, the width of your nail is from here to here. Mm -hmm. So if we drew a straight line up, to here, mm -hmm. your nail wall should go right here. But because it was bugging you and you had been trimming it over to the side, yeah. to the center here. So now as your nail grows, you'll keep this skin nice and moisturized. Mm -hmm. So when it grows up, it will press down, it'll make a new nail wall. Oh, okay. So we don't want to trim anymore from okay. here to here. Yes. So okay. it will, and um, you know, if it does get sore sometimes, you said that you bought these already, right? Yes. So just take this, and you know how if you push on yourself too hard, right. it makes a dent? Yes. So every now and then, just press for 10, 20, 30 seconds okay. to make that little dent. Okay. Because as we sleep, everything grows, and the nail will just grow up a tiny bit. You know, and right. just just help it out a little bit. Keep yes, it keep right. it moisturized. Help okay. it out, and it'll it'll grow right up in there. Okay. The main thing is keeping any of this excess skin away from it because that buildup is what hurts us. Yeah. Okay. But that's what's causing the pain. Okay. All right. So I grew up just north of Cincinnati. Oh, okay. Yeah, in a town called Mason. It's much bigger now than it was when I grew up there. Yes. All the things have been growing. I remember in oh, Ann Arbor. Oh, my. And she had to be in Ann Arbor for that to be repaired at seven months. And when I traveled from Saginaw to Ann Arbor, um, it, there wasn't really much growth, but now down up the there's a area lot there. of farmland then, and it, it seems now from Howell to Ann Arbor, it's just growing right up.
Yeah, this will get soft and I'll be able to get that off. But I'm not gonna force it. I'm gonna See how that calloused area is starting to turn all white now? Uh -huh. So when it starts to turn really white, that's when you know it's ready to come off. Oh, okay. Because if you force it off, that's when you'll do damage to the skin mm -hmm. and create even a like a more injury. Yeah. How's that feel? Fine. Fine. Yeah. Not tender. Oh, all right. I, I've seen advertisements on television or, you know, when they've talked about different things, and, but I never had been there. And then I've seen a sign from there. Oh, must be in this area somewhere. Isn't it? Pretty close. Do you have children? Yes, uh, my son and his wife. And Yellow and red. Uh -huh. Yes, it was a pleasant drive down. The, the sun was the sun out this morning when you came to work. Yeah. Okay. Because I lost the sun long about by Howell, but it looked like from the south the clouds were moving up or from the southwest.
do you think? Thank you so much for taking time out of your day to visit my channel. People like you are the reason for my success and I appreciate it so much. But remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel for all the latest videos. Remember it is free and I'll see you next time.